angazika u prosper jojo ntselu kuti uzi introduce babu kuti ngubani uma kune organization no emele u shoot organization ba Okay, um, Ika Magilia Bona got a lot of screening. Um, the representer, the organization, Abai Bezabatu Loiko. Loiko is a South African organization with this, which is a youth based organization, SA Cape Town. Um, and it's a it's a it's an organization that um seeks to champion um basic human rights for all, but particularly for the people of Matebele land. Um, it's an organization that is focused mostly. We 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 performing arts. We do theatre. We do poetry. We do puppetry. Um, we we do music, and um, through all those forms of art, yes, is a mobile champion. Yes, human rights. We have collaborated with many organizations nationally and internationally. Yes, and a privilege. Yes, we to be represented. Yes, with the platform. Yes, Sia bonga kakul. Sesige sabona lapa licenza umjalo lo uloiko. Okulu maga kulu nge genocide. Outras wuti aguku kupulo welunge lo lo muntu. Ogutula ogutu muntu ashayo nge genocide. So Umanje unga siti nje nga mafishani nje usichele kanyani nje ngomi chalo lono uti kati vele wasuge lapi uti lize lenzu mshalo fana na lono. Ok, um, nge abu nga kulu nkala. E, so, um, umjalo ge esu wenza ge e, umjalo wekonga o ge uh, ebi zoktua uloiko di kukuraoni genocide. Uh, nge enye ge mizalo esi nayo ge uh, lana anda uloiko um, production. And uh, isi zato why we what we ended up doing le play kakulu. It was because um, besi, 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 besi funda nama, nama basic human rights ne? and funda nange mbali ya Afrika. And um, we got conscientized or we, we, we came across the issue of the genocide and uh, and and also got to learn uh, is that why Yabakona and how it also impacted um, Zimbabwe and South Africa and Southern Africa as a whole and um, how it it is it is one of the issues that we we think Uber uh, they've they've contributed to the status quo, uh, especially in, in matters of 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 land, ne? Uh, in in both Zim and South Africa, in matters of land, and uh, just in matters of a true liberation, uh, we believe Uba, the killing, the mercilessly killing of Abantu Bagwamtwagazi or Matebele or Midlands and Matebele land, uh, just after. Uh, the dawn of democracy is a crime that needed to be to be attended to, and uh, we believe Uba, many people were celebrating the killing of the people Bagwam Twagazi during during um, during the 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 the, 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 the eight, eighties. Ne? They were celebrating and they wanted even the death of their leader Ungom, and uh, that the fact that people were celebrating and people were benefiting out of the murder of the people of of Mtuagas and nobody was brought to book. It gave the, 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 the Zimbabwean government reign to do as they please. And it gave them a platform to practice how to, how to, how to marginalize people, how to use brutality as a form of control. And they did that without anyone putting them in check. And the fact that they were given reign to do that uh, has made them to continue to do that and they re and, and 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 for them to retain power they've used that form and that strategy of killing people you know they, they, they they've got a blood trail behind them and they are using they are spilling blood to try to cover that blood trail so we believe that that genocide is very like it, it is the reason why 
the country zim is as it is and why many people basema and even people from all over zimbabwe are all over the world and 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 we believe that that genocide was linked also to the to the liberation of South Africa somehow, and that it delayed the liberation of South Africa. And we, we, we consider the 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 the, the, the I mean the, the, the Lancaster House negotiation and the genocide, as well as the Cortesa negotiations and the, the killing of Chris Sani and the sidelining of Winnie Mandela as one of the same thing, which was aimed at marginalizing the people. And today people are crying and they're killing each other because of poverty. And it stems back to that crime that was done that people need to account to, or people need to be conscientized to. So it, 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 it understanding here to the basis here to uh, and the and the and the and the push of our of our of our activism is based on that 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 crime at least needs to be accounted for. And to date, no one has accounted for that. And the fact that the cronies and the killers and the murderers are running as they please uh, to us it says that there is nothing that is going to happen nothing is going to change uh people are going to be marginalized they are going to be killed like they, they there won't be any change up until we solve that together with many other issues that um the, 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 both the countries are facing um yeah, so I think I think I'll I'll I'll, I'll yeah. Pack. Um, maybe Uma Nina Boz with the Lapeli Hamba Corner, a Guma communities, a South Africa, Lizala Lomjal. Yeah, e awareness, a bantwing, the South Africa, a Nama issues, a bantu bagum twagas, Usugela Vena Lani genocide, discrimination, a Guma spheres won't get a life. In Gaganani awareness. You know, the awareness is great. And sometimes uh, it yes, yes overwhelm. Um because in the format of our play, yeah, we, we don't just make a play, then upon your come. After every play, Sibanama discussions on the matters that we addressed, we play and also trying to come up with solutions on what could be done uh, with, the, with the matters that we raised throughout the play. Um, e, 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 one thing that, that, that many people are not aware of, ne, it is the close links of um, the people of Mtuagazi, Mangisho, uh, and the people of South Africa. Many people don't know that most of the people that I hear are also in, in, in Matebele land. Mm -hmm. And they also don't know of the relationship Yom Kondo is together with the Zipa. So when they come to, to that knowledge, we feel like that kind of history, that part of history has been taken away, has been removed from people. And Abandu, like they can't trace themselves. They don't know. They are, they are, they are shocked when they see Uba and all those uh, 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 tribes that are that side. Most people are shocked first by the fact that they are links, blood links. And they're also shocked by the, the, the links that have to do with, 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 with the struggle for liberation. Like the history is so rich and yet people know little of it. So that on its own is something that is amazing uh, uh, to people. And they do not know that a genocide was committed just next door. And mm -hmm. that's even some of um, South African uh, brothers and sisters were killed together with the people of Matibeda. And some of the people that never returned from exile, that uh, whose who, 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 who families do not know what happened to them. They are lying in in mine shafts and 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 and, and, and shallow graves in Matebele land. So people don't know about that, and they get to know um, about that history, and also get to know about the plight of the people of Mutagas when they when they get here. In that they are regarded as foreigners in in in, in Zimbabwe, uh, second class citizens. Then they come here, which is their motherland then they are also regarded as second class citizens. Yeah. And, 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 and so, so that people get to know and they get to understand, but, oh, there are people that are like this. There are people who have suffered so much and what can we do? 
And um, as I say that this, 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 the, our organization is run by young people, vibrant young people who, 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 who have got a hunger um, for, for, for justice, who have got a hunger for speaking truth to power. And, uh, and uh, we call ourselves, we don't call ourselves actors, we, we, we call ourselves activists. Uh, and everyone who comes within the organization is then schooled into uh, this, this thinking and they are conscientized on the issues that I had. So there is a great level of activism that is done in the, in the community where, as far as we know, we're the first to hold a commemoration of the death of people of Matebele land here in South Africa. We held it in Cape Town, a, a land again, a, 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 a Philippine. We had a, a march, a human rights march, where we called different organizations from Matebele land and as well as from here in South Africa, including Mkonto Wesizwe and many other uh, organizations, political and, 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 and pressure groups and, and NGOs. So we have we have, we have tried to our best ability, and I believe we can even do more to, to wherever we go, whether it's through the play or it's through sport or it's through music or uh, it's through interviews, radio or TV, we always make it a point that uh, we conscientize people on the plight of the people of Matebele land. And the fact that they continue to be marginalized, they continue to be second-class citizens, they continue to be treated as if they have no place to go. So we, we try to, 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 to conscientize people on that, yeah. Okay, you know, see how long I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the government. I'm going to go to the government in South Africa. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. Egating a Kunyagango, we be looking Kunyama Conan by us, Shonkumunto se parliament, a by us, what Abafun we Kulum, a Gerat in Saturday Cape Town, Ben Noguia, a research council upon a immaterial lending, Yatoraga and Dabazaku crown. Some Funu was with Bagaba Sanga and Abuin, Kambi, a government officials, and what was their response? And what is the response of the people that were maybe that they came across? Abage Baba says Zimbabwe, or Rhodesia, but Sangana Nezapu, obey ANC, Umkond, a Bona Bafilanjan, and Alain Tole, and Nale situation as a single man with his Tutulan Ali, season up as Tutulan up to his wheel and Ali. A Moga Pegavan permissional end, when it suits them, we are not Zimbabweans, or a sovereign, a sovereign defender, and when it suits them, we are all Zimbabweans, Master Spandle, one mass. Nyabo. Mbangazi, Tana Gumbozo. Okay, Mbangwone, Lapo, Vodloza, Nalombozo. Okay, so um, we have, we have, um, we have met with quite an, a number and we've attempted to meet with some, but um, you see, you, you know, <laughs> the issue, Eye Kukura Hundi, it's, um, it's a it's a very touchy issue, ne? The 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 the, 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 um, the diplomatic ties that SA now has with uh, with Zim, as well as the the continuous plundering of the resources of Zim by South African top politicians who have got mines, uh, and they are they are, they are, they, are, they, are, they are receiving a lot of riches, plundering a lot of riches out of out of out of Matebele land and out of Sim as, as as a whole. That kind of a relationship that they have, not so many are willing to come out and speak openly about the issue of Kukurahundi. But I would like to tell you uh, that we met with high officials from army generals to Mkonto Wesizwe. A cadres, a, and some politicians who said to us when we when we were when we were speaking about the issue because we 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 we, we first we were offered not received we were offered bribes to sign to to be silent about the issue of Ukukura. when we received when, we received, when received, you refused the bribes we then got uh, threats uh, on our lives that we should keep keep quiet 
but we we refused to do that. We, we continued speaking about it because when we when we were speaking about it, it was it was not as popular as it is. It was kind of like taboo. Even even our own families were afraid uh, when we spoke about the matter. So I can tell you now that we met with some top officials that came to us and told us, speak as loud as you can. No one will touch you. That's what we're told. So we're given free reign to speak. That's why wherever we went, whether it, it was on television, whether it was on radio, we were not afraid to call Mugabe and his cronies murderers and rapists and arsonists. We're not afraid to do so because we're given free reign to speak uh, on the matter. <clears throat> but many were not willing to be to be publicly associated with us. Um, that's 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 that that has been our 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 connection with top officials and 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 and, and as I said that some are silent now not because uh, they don't know what happened but it is because they are they are receiving huge amounts of money out of the diamonds out of the gold that they are plundering in Matebele land and and, and uh, in Zimbabwe as a whole so 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 we, we believe. Also, oh, and, 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 and another thing, what, what, what we, the question that, what are their feelings uh, about those that met with, with, with the Zipra and they were in Zim and they lived in Zim? Uh, when we were, I don't know, maybe some of you were at, at, the, at, the, at the march that we had uh, and on and the Human Rights Day, the, the Mkonto Oasis were, um, representatives that were there they told us but no we know we're fighting together now we are just waiting for you to give us a command so that we can go back to the bush basically that, that's what they're saying they were calling for him yeah, but, um, but we know but now not so many people have got I mean people have got power but uh, now people can say stuff and not and not and not back it up with with action so <clears throat> so yeah many many people feel that we have been um, done wrong, uh, but some, they don't have the power to change anything. Um, even the fact that some know that their brothers are still in, in, in mine shafts, they can't touch that issue because uh, it's, it's a very, it's a, it's, 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 in, terms of, in terms of diplomatic ties with Zim, they can't address that issue, the issue of Ikukurao. They can't address it because once they, they, they begin to address it, it has to come out that some of the people that are not here, that did not come from exile, are still in mine shafts. That the, so so it's it's a very it's a very I mean uh, people who there are people who participated in the genocide, um, but then then there are people who perpetuate the effects of the genocide, and some of the top politicians are now perpetuating the marginalization and the and the subjugation of the people of Matebele land. And that's why they, they, they can't openly speak about the subject. But those that we've met with, they said, speak as loud as you can. No one will do anything to you. OK. I know. See you next time. I need the George Oba. Umbonuako in Operation Tutula. Uti. OK. Um, <laughs> uh, Mbono wa mi operation tutula number one man kale I think um i I will also nam say uba I I don't I don't think uba operation tutula fundamentally what it stands for ne uh, it should be operational like South Africa or anyway mangi shogi because if if you realize uba ama genocide at Kadaganjani it starts by othering. A people and making them over these people are are the reason why we are suffering, and 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 organizations like Operation Tutula, I I I I don't think they should they should find a, a space within our communities where to but yeah they find space within our communities because when there is a lack of leadership, ne, uh, anyone can assume authority and people will respond to authority, especially Abantu who are. Who are, who are in a position of desperation. A classic example is that Ma, now it's, it's Lord Shedding, 
somebody decides to stand by the robots and direct the traffic, whoever is coming, they will, will respond to that and will, 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 will respond to the authority alone, whether whether a boy is out, but because they have assumed a position of responsibility, people tend to, 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 to follow them, even if um, it does not matter who they are, as long as, as they've taken a, a position of authority, especially when people are desperate. And, 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 and my, 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 my take like on, on that, it, it goes back again to the, to the, to, to the, to the point that I had raised, Uba, people do not know. Gashle, gashle. People are not are not aware. And 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 touch uh, issue after Ama two thousand figure aba fana or abandwana aba abangalaleli. You see, in in our in our in our in our in our, in our, in our activism, ne? we have a lot of conversations with South African young people. We have a lot of conversation with Zimbabwean, especially Matebele young people. What, what we have realized is that many Matebele young people uh, have kind of like lost hope on Matebele then. They've, they've, they've literally lost hope on Matebele. They said, what can we do? There's nothing we can do. They've given up and, and they have no they have no claim to it. They, 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 they feel like there's nothing that they can do. And that, 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 that thing of giving up and not having a, any feeling about they don't have power, they can't do anything. It is also because of Ilan Dugan, a, 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 a cultural imperialism and the genocide that continued after a, after the, the merciless killing of people. So people kind of like feel hopeless and they're giving up. And 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 they 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 they, they come here, abandoning. They've given up a, a, a kaya. They come here. There are no opportunities. They're not documented. And then they get that mindset. But we can do whatever we want to do, and earn that money through whether robbery or whatever forms of 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 of, of, of that are illegal. Then they they, they 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 get to do that. And 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 and. And 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 in in, in addressing such issues, Sambi, uh, locally, Ubando Bazela na basuka panga and also a a the young South Africans, a young South Africans as well. I I feel like I feel like the operation that does not address the fundamental issues, which is uh, which are issues of of, of depravity, of of not having. It is it is targeting Amaz 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 Zimbabweans as the people that are causing uh, all these you know um, ills of the society. It's like they are this plague that is causing Amaz South Africans not to have jobs. They are taking all the jobs. Uh, they are they are they are killing people. So they they are now the scapegoat. And the actual truth is that anyone who is who who who, who is a true leader who is concerned about a social cohesion, who is concerned about social development, who is, who is concerned about bringing community, communities into together and social development. Anyone who has got a whim of, 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 of knowledge, you don't even have to go and study at school, just a brief research will tell you that if you are intending to develop a community, you can't start by isolating certain people and you can't start by isolating or you can't start by targeting the very marginalized. Any way of, of any way of developing a society, it is looking at the marginalized and empowering the marginalized. And I don't feel Operation Tutula is doing that. And because of that, I, I feel like it is it is it is counter, it is countering a development of South Africa. And it is countering a, the, 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 the true emancipation of people. They should be looking at developing people, bringing people together, social cohesion, not targeting Abantu. And 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 Amaz Zimbabweans, they are the they are the they are the they are the, they are the less they don't have power to change the economic structure. Yes, South Africa. They can't give people jobs. They can't. They can't. They can't arrest people. They, 
they literally can't do anything of, of great effect to change the conditions of the people of South Africa. And therefore making them targets and making them uh, abandu, aba, aba causa, the social ills of South Africa, I think it's, 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 it's lack of, of, of innovation. And I think it's people who are opportunistic, who are, who are, pla who are, who are taking advantage of, 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 of Aband who, who are desperate and that they are using people to, 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 to climb up and to, 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 to gain uh, access and power to the hearts of people. I don't think it's a, it's, a, it's a valid, I understand the things that they are crying about. We are crying about the same thing. The same people about rob us, South Africans are the same people that rob us. They, 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 they have got no discrimination. Crime has got no discrimination. Here, here in Cape Town, Elokshin, most of the people that kill people are South Africans. Most of the people that kill people are South Africans. And most of the people that they kill are South Africans. So it's, it's criminal, they are criminal activities and they are crying about that. But pointing all those things to Zimbabweans, I think it's, it's, it's scapegoatism and it's, it's lack of, for a lack of, of, of a better word, it's lack of, of really thinking and engaging the issues that I play and, 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 and clamoring for supremacy through, through, through all these um, Operation Tutula and, 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 and the Gaten uh, McKenzie and uh, Action SA um, uh, movement. So I, I really think that they are not focusing on the, on the right uh, people. They are not, they are not focusing on the on on the, on what will bring change to 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 to, to the general populace, targeting Zimbabweans is not going to put bread on the table. Neither is it going to give people land or open job opportunities. It is not going to do that. They are the least people that can bring about a change in the SA. They are failing to target the people that have got power and authority, and they are targeting the lower hanging fruit. And I think it's it's very lazy in thinking and, um, and very careless and will result in the death of people. And initially they said they were against uh, illegal immigrants. But they don't want any Zimbabweans. So the next thing, they and the next thing South Africans will be killing each other. That's the natural progression of what they are getting into now. So that's my thought. Operation Tutula. Hi. Yes, 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 I later map my opportunities. Abandon my home targets. I got I think I think uh, I'll just echo what um, Amanya Makabani Ami uh, have said. But I think I think I think a uh, it's high time that we amplify light year two as abandon my home targets. That's it's, it's it's high time that we need to amplify it. And I've been watching go 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 TikTok back on and abando ba abayazi lemba da ba kuluma gaio on social media. I've been I've been seeing it running rounds um, uh, in many places. I've communicated with some people, but yeah, I think I think it is it is an opportunity for 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 running together uh, and master rally together and also amplifying the voices that we have already been. Been, been, been saying Uba, the, 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 they are two different these are two different people who are suffering from two different things um abanye they really don't have a place to go to um uh, abanye they they are just seeking for economic uh, opportunities abanye it's it's, 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 an, it's a matter of identity it's a matter of i think it's been we are we are state without borders I think we need to we need to get to that that point that we're we're a state without borders, a state without land. 
no matter you can claim what well, there is land you can go back or whatever but the honest truth is that you are not regarded as a citizen uh you will be treated a, as a second class citizen so what then must must be done i think this is high time that we need to rally together we need to ba slanga ni samakanda we need to ba sibone sana ba from from politicians to uh ama ama, ama pressure groups to uh ama academics to business people they need to come together and speak with one voice and i think i think i think i think now is the time now is the right time that that since everyone is just speaking about this operation to do like here operation to do like now abanye abantu they were even shocked to umuntu obule we munyathi but unyathi is supposed to be a south african how is it yabo so it is high time that people need to amplify with the loudest voice that okay this is an opportunity for us to speak our truth uba okay you see what is happening here you have to do la but what do you expect us to go because this the very same reason why we are here it is this so i think i think i do think that he, it's high time that we 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 rally together and um it, it, as i said in the beginning uba uh, or in part of my conversation uba when we were engaging uh people of umtogas like people have given up like they are really most people have given up you know we found a lot of support from locals rather than from people of matimbele especially in, in cape town like people did not even want to go watch the play because they fear but there is a cio there is somebody who's going to be watching then they'll follow me after this and kill me or whatever people are have been have been led by fear and if, even at this point when it is an opportunity to speak out many people are going to cower they are going to hide and not say anything why it is because of fear that's why we called ourselves uloiko which is a cause for 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 fear we don't want to uh, be, be be ruled by fear and we refuse that people should subjugate other people and treat them ill because of fear so we are trying to say let's break away from the scourge of fear and live free because there's no freedom in 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 fear there's no there's no freedom now at this point it is time that people should cry aloud and and seek for their freedom and there is freedom in expression but people are not even able to express and say but this is our plight this is our situation we are trying to hide so that you can't even cough because you fear uba bazo kubona now you become part of it i think i think i think it was brave um uh for 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 uh uba bose pumile for going to that meeting that stakeholders meeting it was very brave this is what is needed at this point in time uba when opportunities like this come you need to 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 speak of your own issues and uh, and uh, there's no other time there's no other time now is the time that's what i feel uba should be so that's why nati when when we when we saw things happening we put out a statement as uloiko uba we are against this and this is our this is our stance um so 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 it is time to cry aloud and spare not Okay. I see abo nga kakhulu mpangazitha eh baba mpangazitha eh ama zwako kugcina ba Eh first and foremost eh mangivala ngizocela ubonga nje for the opportunity efana nale and um I would think uba such platforms eh zibaleke kakhulu eh conscientizing people um and tina ke as part of what we have been doing a lot ne we realize the the great need of conscientizing people um and and conscientizing people gets allies it gets us allies and it gets it gets us new ideas because sometimes mausu phakathi kwento kakhulu sometimes eh ucabanga ngolaka eh you can't you can't you can't have a a a a a constructive a conversation with your abuser you are speaking out of you know out of anger you you can face them gahle ngokukhulisa nabo so i think um conscientizing and getting more people involved in the issue makes you to think 
at different. So to the people that I hear, I'll say Uba, continue doing that. And uh Abantu ge Aba La Lele Clownbeish. Uh, we know why situation is difficult, but um, be resourceful and try to find other means um, of, 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 of finding a living. And we figure a figure figure yeah, I'm a P one and it's just uh I think it would chapel cool and it must stop and it must be a, I mean we must we must we must categorically call it what it is, it is wrong. Uh but to maybe South Africans will come and listen to this. Um we say Uba look differently at the people of Matebele Land. Their case is very is very uh, serious and it's very dire and um, a, and it needs attention and by the look of things nobody was wanting to 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 to, to handle this hot potato and to the people of Mtwagas, we have seen throughout the years that no one is willing to take your issue even those that were allies during the liberation struggle are now perpetuating the oppression of your people and your children so the only person who has got a solution will it matter. It is the people of Mtwagas. You can only find a solution because no one is trying to find a solution to the issue. They are just trying to keep you silent and make sure that you don't speak about it. But it is your responsibility to find your freedom. And it is your responsibility to teach how other nations should, should treat you no one will, will, will do that for you. No one. It is your responsibility. I see a woman cool.